When the FBI was asked, was this suspect on their radar, they said at this point in the investigation, it's too early to comment. Okay. Did searches of the suspect's apartment, recovering computer equipment, and several bags of potential evidence. The suspect's father told the Minneapolis Star Tribune his son was a Somalian student in his 20s, while an online message from a group linked to ISIS claiming the attacker was a soldier of ISIS. But so far, authorities say there is no solid evidence to verify that claim. In the small Minnesota town home to hundreds of Somali refugees, community leaders say they are speaking out against the violence and fear the possibility of anti-Muslim backlash. This community does not condone terrorism, does not support terrorism. One by one, stretchers streamed out of a Minnesota mall. Shots fired and then people stabbed. Victims of a stabbing rampage at the hands of a suspect dressed in a security uniform, attacking at least nine people with a knife. Everybody locked their doors and took off running. Inside the mall, a lockdown for hours as police tried to calm the nerves of hundreds of shoppers caught in the chaos. It's going to take a while. Calm down. Witnesses say the suspect yelled about Allah and Islam during the attack. He just charged me with the knife and he said, are you a Muslim, are you a Muslim? Police say the man with a knife stabbed nine men and women ages 15 through 53 before he was confronted by an off-duty officer about five minutes into the violent spree. The mayor is calling that officer, Jason Falkner, a hero. If not for him being there, uh, clearly this would have been much worse than it was. Now, the FBI is looking into this case as a potential act of terror. And we are now being told that all nine victims have been released from the hospital. All of them are expected to make a full recovery. Matt and Savannah, back all right. to you. Gotti Schwartz in St. Cloud, Minnesota. Gotti, thank you very much. Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.